Hi everyone, I'm Nona Diandi here. Today I will share how to create this long typography effect. Upload your photo and I will use this element. I will crop it here and then I will add a square and change the color to this yellow. And then I will increase the size. Okay, and then send it to back. Now I will type text L, enter, O, enter, P, enter, E. I will change the font to a thick font like Archival Black. And then I will increase the size and reduce the line spacing. I will decrease the size like this. I will reduce the line spacing more. Like this, so I can increase the size of the text. Okay. Now I'll change the color of the text to white. And then I will add a square in white color. And I will place it here. And then I will duplicate it and place it for the O. Increase the length here. For the V, and let's make it like this. And for the E. Okay, now add this. Go to shape and see all. And then add this shape. Change to white. Reduce the size. Place it here. All right. Now I will duplicate this rectangle. Change to yellow. I will crop it like this. I will place it here. I will duplicate and place it here. Duplicate and duplicate again to be placed here. Duplicate, replace here. All right. And then add a square in yellow and reduce the size, crop it a little, I will place it here, reduce the transparency so I can see the real size of this hole and then click this corner rounding, add a corner rounding. All right, and then move it back here and change the transparency to 100. Now duplicate this page and on page 2, go to position and then remove the photo. Now download it as PNG, page 2 only. Okay, now go to page 1 and in position. Remove all element and remain the photo and then upload the PNG of page 2 here. Increase the size to fit the page and click BG Remover. Select the photo and adjust the position. You can also increase the size. Like this. Okay, and crop it. Now select the frame and go to edit. Go to the button. Custom. Change the highlight to totally white. You can see the hex code here. And also the shadow to totally white. Now you have it. Click the frame and then go to edit. And click shadow. Add drop shadow, adjust the distance uh, like this, 12 maybe, go to position, or you can slide it here, and crop it here. Now select the bold, and I will increase the size a little, and then go to position, select the image and duplicate, 
they move background place it right on the origin and then add more element like this instagram like icon send to back all right so now you have it see you next video and have fun with canva